The remarkable thing for me is an intimate relationship between black hole physics and quantum computing. Jacob Beckenstein, colleague of Stephen Hawking's, noticed in a simple calculation that you can answer the question, how much information can a black hole store? That's a strange thing to say. How does something store information? You need some structure, you need atoms. Well, turns out the information content is equal to the surface area of the event horizon in square Planck units. What's a Planck unit? It's the smallest distance that we can talk about sensibly. The questions it raises, how is information stored? Why is the information content of a region of space equal to the surface area surrounding that region rather than the volume? If I asked you how much information can you store in your room, let's say it's a library, then you would say, well, it's to do with how many books I can fit in the room. But black holes seem to be telling us that there's something about the surface.